find the equation of the tangent plane to the explicitly defined surface, z is equal to the natural exponential raised to the xy at the point 3, 0. So the first thing that we want to do is find that point p0 as the ordered triplet. So we want to define this as a, b, f of a. And we're given here the a and b values. We have that a is 3 and b is 0. So we can say z is defined as f of 3, 0. And substituting this into our given function, we have the natural exponential raised to the 0, which is 1. So therefore, p naught, which again is a, b, f of a, b, is defined as 3, 0, 1. And so we're now ready to go ahead and find the normal vector defined by the gradient. So we have the partial derivative of our function with respect to x is going to be y times the natural exponential raised to the xy. We have the partial derivative of the function with respect to y leaves us with x times the natural exponential raised to the xy and evaluating at the ordered pair, 3, 0, the partial derivative with respect to x becomes 0, times the natural exponential raised to the 0, which is just 0, and the partial derivative with respect to y at 3, 0 leaves us with 3 times the natural exponential raised to the 0, which is 3. And so therefore, the gradient at the point 3, 0 is defined by the components 0, 3. And we're now ready to find the equation of the tangent plane. So as always, we'll keep in mind here that z is defined as the partial derivative of x at that point a, b, multiplied by x minus a, plus the partial derivative of the function with respect to y at the point a, b, multiplied by y minus b, plus our surface f evaluated at the point a, b. And plugging in everything we just found, we have z is equal to 0 multiplied by x minus 3 plus 3 multiplied by y minus 0 plus 1. And so simplifying here, we see that the entire x component goes to 0, and we'll distribute 3 through to both terms. So we have z is equal to 3y plus 1. And bringing all of our variables to one side, we are left with the equation of the tangent plane z minus 3y is equal to 1. And that is our beautiful final answer.